Continuing on the custom card review streak, we're going to be talking about a custom Devil May Cry card. And it's coming in from Jeff. You might not call you Jeff. I mean, hey, it's Jeff who, but I'm going to call you Jeff, all right? So, um, uh, wow, I had a complete brain fart. I'm leaving that in the video. Send me custom cards over to bhdevcustomcards at gmail.com so I can get to your custom card in the near future. I'm getting all these older custom cards out the way. This was sent to me April 6th of this year. We are getting very, very close to catching up. We are. Um, so in the uh, email for uh, the, the little DMC card, what is that? A, I, I forgot who it was. Is it Virgil? Uh, it, he says, uh, PS, standby finish, also detransforms Virgil. Okay. So without further ado, let's take a look at this card. Now, um, I did skim through this card just a little bit. And I'm not going to lie. Uh, and when, I, when I'm at skim, I really just skimmed a very tiny bit. The first thing I saw was this ridiculous 12 key super, like what, 50% attack and defense for five turns? That is like uber strong. That is crazy good. Okay. All right. So he is, uh, he's extreme AGL. Um, of course he's an LR and, uh, uh it's Virgil. Yeah, it is Virgil. Okay. So, Motivated Gaze <clears throat> of Judgment, Virgil Sparta, as you say it. Alright, so his leader skill is 3 key and 1 70% to all stats to crossover, battle of wits, or full power. And his 30% of the stats, of course, that being his additional for his 200% leader skill, is battle of fate, accelerated battle, or sibling spawn. Editing dev, you already know what to do. So, uh, editing dev here, I think that I confused the little standby fish like i'm editing right now as we speak guys let me just go ahead and mute my audio on my computer so it doesn't like blast you guys ears so it says uh he says ps standby finish also d transforms virgil so the standby finish i noticed while i'm editing i think that i got wrong that after he does his little little standby uh you know attack thing um that it uh that it keeps him in that form. So if throughout the video that I say that he does that, like I'm wrong, okay? So going forth, ignore anything I'm saying incorrect about the little transforming Virgil thing, like the detransforming. I just wanted to put that out there because I noticed while editing that um, I'd be, I'd just be overlooking stuff. It says standby finish also detransforms Virgil. Editing dev, I'm here to save you dev, don't worry, I'm here to save you, but yeah, um. Hey, back to the video, man. Back to the video. So I pulled it up and, uh, huh? Okay. Uh, Jiren, Beast Gohan, the Gammas. Um, of course you have the fraud Blue Boys, but I love those frauds personally. But just gonna throw it in there. Uh, <laughs> um, you have uh, LREB. Um, there are quite a few. Of course, you have Dragon Fist. Yeah. Looking all right. Looking all right. How many Super Easy A's on here? I probably skimmed over the Super Easy A's. Anyways, I'm back on over to the Virgil. So his 12 key, Hell of Blades. He gets 50% attack and defense for five turns while doing colossal damage to the enemy. And his 18 key, Court of Judgment, fire name for his 18 key. 100% attack and defense for one turn, and he does mega colossal damage to the enemy. So he has strong super attack effects. And his passive, what's your motivation? He gets four key. I'm, I'm covering. I'm sorry, guys. Let me just go ahead and move myself right over here. Perfect. Okay. So let me just scroll all the way down so you guys can see the little domain too. So he gets four key and 200% attack and defense just at the start of the turn and he gets an additional 100% attack and defense and launches an additional attack that has a 50% chance to become a super attack when performing a super attack so he gets free attack and defense and additional super attack chance for just for him doing a super attack and he also performs an additional attack that has a 70% chance to become a super attack when key is 18 or more so he gets rewarded for getting above a key threshold I do like that and he just performs a guaranteed super when his key is at 24 okay so that's three plus supers just out the gate all right. And he performs a guaranteed crit when key is 24 
when own or someone else's domain is active, including enemy domain. Okay, so he just has guaranteed crits built into him. If this guy has two keeper keys to obtain and is making his own orbs, just he's gonna be his. That'd just be ridiculous. <laughs> um. Anyways, where are we at? Ah, uh, there we are. So he has a seventy percent chance to nullify super attacks and countering them with tremendous power. So it doesn't matter which one it is. He just nullifies all types of super attacks. He has a 70% chance to do that too. That is very strong. And he gets two key per key sphere obtained. How did I know? What do you even get to that part? Like, <laughs> I read line for line. I don't be like skimming through it uh, for any of these custom cards. I just go line for line. I just assume that there's most likely, oh, I said if there's two key per keys for obtain. So yeah, he gets two key per keys for obtain. So that's very strong uh, considering the fact that that's going to coincide very well with him getting rewarded for getting to 24 key, 18 key, and just for him super attacking in general. That's very good. And he also has a 50% chance to dodge as the first attacker in a turn. That is obviously quite nice. And he performs a guarantee super when being attacked before attacking or when this character is the third attacker in return so that's four super attacks built into his kit um a couple of them being uh, additional super attack changes and just two of them being guaranteed super just right there um and he also gets 20 percent attack and defense per attack received up to 100 percent and he gets 10 percent attack and defense up to 50 percent with each super attack performs as just five supers which he can do five supers on turn one he has two additional super attack chances built into him with two guaranteed supers built into him so he does his first super um you get lucky he does his two additional super attack uh, chances that gets to become a super attack so that's three supers he does his two guaranteed supers that's five supers and then what's that that's another super from his potential system um okay and he gets 20 percent damage reduction just unrestricted and he gets an additional 30 percent damage reduction for five turns <laughs> so he not only can do two guarantee supers as well as get two additional super attack chances but he also has 50 percent damage reduction just on top of each other for within those five turns with a 50 percent chance to dodge uh built-in crit two keeper keys are obtained to help this guy get to his key threshold to get these super attack chances as well as the guarantee super just off um what is there to say he also has a 70 percent chance to <laughs> nullify super attacks and counter them so i mean just run down the list again he has a 50 percent chance to dodge 50 percent damage reduction he builds up all his attack and defense very easily he gets two guarantee supers built into him was as well as two additional super attack changes built into him two guarantee crits um i mean you guys you guys see the proof is just right there it's it's pretty crazy this is a very nutty passive anyways the uh standby skill thin devil trigger he transforms into true devil and creates domain top of now i'm gonna butcher this word top of cleefoth Cle or it's or is it queefoth I butchered the hell out of that word. Tree for five turns. And of course, this is a little D transformation because I'm pretty sure he specified inside the email. So, uh, the domain, uh, accelerated battle or battle of fate characters, enemies, of course, enemies and allies get 30% attack and defense. Nice. And Virgil becomes immune to negative effects. <laughs> so you can't be attack debuffed, defensive debuffed. I mean, okay. Can't be stunned, sealed, locked. Okay. <laughs> okay. This is the domain, by the way, with the little, uh, I'm not going to say it again, top of the tree, <laughs> five turns, and then we get Virgil, Sin, Devil, Trigger, that looks fire. Okay, this, this is looking, okay, look at the, look at this, bro, look at this standby finish slash active skill, bro. <laughs> All right, so it's massive, five key and 500% attack and defense. Let me repeat that. Five key and 500% attack and defense. And also one thing I forgot to mention for his base form is that you guys remember how I said that he has two guaranteed supers built into him with two additional super attack chances built into him. Um, 
can we just point out the fact that after he does his 18 key super, he has a stupidly strong 12 key. Um, okay. All right. Um, anyways, let's see what we have here. So five key and 500% attack and defense at the start of turn. And he gets 150% attack and defense when performing a super attack. Very strong. And he performs guaranteed crits, just unrestricted. Okay. He performs two guaranteed supers when performing a super attack. So we're up to three plus supers because he does his first super and does two guaranteed supers just for free. Looking very strong because he's not restricted on guaranteed crits as well as his two guaranteed supers. Uh, you just perform a super attack. And he breaks an enemy action when key is 24, strong, or when HP is 50% or less, or, uh, oh, that's not or, I just said, wait, yeah, 50% or less breaks an enemy action per attack performed when attacking, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm getting completely jumbled up. Okay, so it says breaks an enemy action when key is 24, or when HP is at 50% or less, breaks an enemy action per attack performed when attacking and per attack received before attacking <laughs> oh bro bro <laughs> okay and it says uh creator note rip red zone zamasu and shadow dragon omega lol indeed he guards as the first attacker in a turn. Okay, just nice. And he gets 5% damage reduction per keys are obtained. And he gets an additional 10% damage reduction per rainbow keys are obtained. And he guarantees to change an entire row to rainbow key spheres once only. So, fills one charge and every charge adds 50% attack per attack performed. So, three plus supers, guarantee crits, 500% uh, attack and defense. I, that cannot be understated at all. He also gets an attack and defensive buff from his pass to his super attack effects. Um, he breaking enemy action, ridiculous, obviously. Guard, uh, damage reduction per key sphere and rainbow key sphere obtained. It's both key spheres, by the way. And he changes a, a, a random row, right? Is it a random row? Yeah, he changes the entire row two rainbow key spheres once only so of course you can only get five rainbow key spheres i mean that's 50 percent damage reduction and let's say for the sake of us going into the next turn we get a good amount of key spheres uh let's see you get i don't know six key spheres um he's gonna be looking all right in slot one it's he's just gonna be looking uh quite all right in slot one what's that's 30% damage reduction for six key spheres because of course six plus five is six plus five six times five six times five is a uh, 30 <laughs> yo excuse me guys um strong I don't know what to say he sits in slot one first turn stupid strong first turn and then as he the fight progresses on he I mean, what do I even say it's just what do I say I mean, come on now it's <laughs> This is crazy. <laughs> um, is he missing anything? I would say no. No. Well, I think if he was a rainbow orb changer, he'd be he'd be so stupidly strong if he was a rainbow orb changer, bro. That would be he would just be he's already ridiculously strong now. I'm <laughs> he's already strong now. Anyways, uh his standby uh finish slash active skill judgment cut end master raises attack for six turns that's 100 percent attack so 100 percent attack for six turns and deals super ultimate damage to all enemies okay and he performs guarantee crits with any turn of activation i'm pretty sure enemy's gonna fucking explode when you use this 50 percent attack and defense and reduces damage received by 30 percent and guards attacks for the rest of the battle okay <laughs> um breaks five enemy actions upon activation if there's only one enemy left which of course you're gonna be facing one enemy so the aoe is just like a sprinkle on top of just 
just greatness uh and destroys current domain when activated reference of jce cutting through the fabric of reality and shattering it like glass conditions can well it can be activated when hp is 50 percent or less and becomes an active skill or when domain top of i'm not even going to say that word tree is activated and becomes a standby finish bbb shocking speed legendary power fierce battle brainiacs demonic ways makes sense over in the flash links make sense categories are as shown um well if you're watching this on like uh i don't know what if let's say like you're working out or like you're doing uh, i don't know um homework and you're just listening to this because i've heard in the past that people have told me that my videos are good for like you know listening just like you know good background noise, right and i don't mind that at all how you doing by the way uh hope you're getting that homework done but so i'm just gonna read all the categories out for anybody who's just listening with like headphones so the categories is siblings bond crossover full power battle of wits resurrected warriors battle of fate accelerated battle bond a master and disciple bond a parent and child because sparta taught him and dante how to fight and both sparta's children had a strong bond with their mother and that's the categories and the extra note that uh jeff left for me love your vids dev hopefully you'll see this card in the next custom card review so uh strong d transformation i come on now this is like an offensive and defensive demon i mean turn one you cannot die um offense through the moon um I'm, I'm assuming that his super attack effects don't change he's also a support type unit by the way just to put that out there because obviously the domain so he's just supplying that from his domain um pre-transformation strong post-transformation strong the only thing i i can't even change anything about this card if this card is strong no like possibly there's no stats by the way for any of my nice stats junkies out there that's about it jeff thank you for sending this card i mean i know it's jeff who but you know maybe call you jeff you know that i'm not even gonna say the Lord, my name is jeff joke but yeah uh send me custom cards i'm gonna be jeff custom cards at gmail.com so i get to your custom card in the, in the near future i'm getting all these older custom cards out the way um yeah w card thank you jeff for sure i love the card love the card um i've never played a dmc game a little devil may cry game but my brother plays in it he tells me it's pretty good I think it's pretty good oh, should, hey should I, should, should I play i don't know i don't know twitch low-key i ain't alive and i've been lazy to stream but yeah i appreciate you guys watching you guys are the best i'll catch you guys next week. i love you all peace